Hey guys, uh, today is Monday, November 4th, 2013. It is my week 42 post-op lap band, and um, it's a good week. <laughs> um, last week I was 211.2. Um, this week I'm 207.7. That is a three and a half pound loss. Um, that also takes me to my second big goal. Uh, 50 was my first, and today was 70 pounds down from my highest weight, which was almost exactly a year ago today. Um, so yeah, 70 pounds down. That feels really nice. I dicked around for a couple months in the summer, and... Um, I didn't really lose anything and uh, so it feels good to finally break the stall and lose again and meet a goal that feels really really good um, I started doing stuff that worked stuff that I did in the beginning um, protein shake for breakfast whether I'm hungry or not um, or cottage cheese with a little bit of honey and cinnamon on it um, a lot of water. Water, 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 water. Um, I've been turning music on 24-7. Well, not 24-7, but a lot of music. Um, and I dance everywhere I go. I dance to the kitchen. I dance to the bathroom. I <laughs> dance while I'm cooking. Uh, just trying to make a conscious effort to move all the time. Um... I started taking bee pollen week before last. Uh, it is called Zizu Tang Bee Pollen. Um, at some point I will do a review about, about it. Uh, I'm not going to do one yet because it's only been two weeks. Um, probably at a month I'll do a review. I will say that it does give me a lot of energy. Um, it seems to have detoxed my system. And that's leveled out this week. I haven't had the you know, pooping problem that I was having the first week. Um, but I can't say, for me, I, I read an FDA warning that said, be careful, some of these um, may contain um, the same chemical that was in Meridia. I don't know if you guys remember Meridia. It was taken off the market in 2010 and banned in a lot of countries. And they said that there could be and has been found in some of these, um, the main ingredient that was in Meridia, which is an oral anorexiant. Uh, so I don't know if I got the batch with the chemicals in it or if I got the all natural batch, but whatever it is, it's some good shit. Um, I'm not sure that I'm going to buy another bottle. Uh, if this gets me over that three month stall and, uh, once you start doing better, you want to keep doing better. So you improve your eating habits and uh, you start to feel really good and you want to keep doing good. So, I don't know. We'll see what happens. I'll do a review in a month and let you guys know and give you more information on it. Um, I've been monitoring my blood pressure and stuff with it because it says it um, you know, it could cause rapid heart heart rate if it has this other drug in it. My resting heart rate today was 74 not too shabby. Um, it's not great, but it's, it's, you know, it seems like if it had some sort of stimulant in it, like amphetamine kind of thing, it would, my resting heart rate would be up higher than that. My blood pressure is also really, really good, so we'll see. I'll keep monitoring it, and we'll see how that goes. Um, I did have a couple treats this week, um, well, last week. Halloween, took the grandkids, I went with them trick-or-treating, and I ate some of the milk duds, because I like milk duds, the little tiny, single halloween size ones. Um, I ate, oh my gosh, we went through McDonald's to get a tea one day, and they had this little sign there for a pralines and cream McFlurry, I got the snack size one. Shit. It's a good thing it's there for a limited time only because I've gone back to get three of them. So this week I had three pralines and cream McFlurries, uh, some Halloween candy, 
a lot of protein, a lot of water, and a lot of exercise. Um, NSV for this week. Um, I guess it's an NSV. It was unintentional. Uh, I had a date night with myself. And it was really nice. Uh, my husband works nights, and a lot of times I'm just bored and watch TV all night. Uh, took a bath. I put on makeup for absolutely no reason. Uh, I dressed kind of skimpy and sexy and put on music that was nice. And uh, Pandora Sade Radio, I think is what I had it on. And I danced all kind of sexy and watched myself in the mirror. And I felt sexy. I felt, I felt pretty. And then I attacked my husband when he came home. <laughs> um, so that was really nice. Uh, I had a date night with myself and I kind of liked me. Uh, I dressed up and, you know, looked, did stuff I haven't done in a long, long time. Like I remember as a teenage girl, looking in the mirror and putting on makeup and primping and smiling and, you know, practicing that smile you're going to give that guy when you see him. I did all those things again as a 41-year-old woman who's lost a lot of weight and I was trying to look at myself through somebody else's eyes because I always see the fat girl in the mirror and so... I went on a date with myself, and it was nice, and I liked me, and that was really good. So that's my NSV for this week. Um, I hope everybody's having a good week. Uh, oh, I have to say, too, that that loss, that three-and-a-half-pound loss, was during period week. That is a mega NSV in itself. It's been a long time since I lost weight on my period, and... That's just awesome. Anyway, uh, this video is getting kind of long. Hope everybody has a great week. I hope you all lose really big. And I will see you next week for week 43. Bye, guys.